day, human Latiosites. This is Latios Azubril, and welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Shuffle. So, let's begin. Last time, we went after, well, Mega Gyarados. And we started working on the new mission cards. This time we have, well, first of all, Registeel, Regice, and Regirock are back, along with the Rotom Daily Challenges. Celebi is back, and this week, Wednesday through, is it Friday or Saturday? I think it might be four days, I'm not positive. Jirachi is back, you get one chance a day. So those of you on mobile, this is this week is your chance to go get that Jirachi. It is really useful, especially with Steelix and Mawile. As your Mega Evolutions. I don't think Mega Steelix is out on mobile quite yet, but for Mega Mawile, Jirachi is definitely helpful with that Mega Boost Plus and a very respectable attack power. That said, new Escalation Battle, Giratina in its origin form. Um, from what I've heard, it's it's okay. I don't know. It's a um, timed Escalation Battle. The rewards are a little different this time around, so there's no Real big level 50 reward, it gets level 40 for a skill swapper, 70 for a speed up, 100 for another skill swapper, 130 for a medium skill booster, and 150 for another speed up, and it goes up to 300. So, we're going to try this out. Hopefully we can catch this thing early on, although I don't think it matters too much when you think of, when you get down to it, probably kind of a moot thing, but nevertheless, let's do this. And while we're at it, perhaps we can get one of these um, missions done. Alright, so these missions aren't going to happen. I apologize, I haven't been working on these mission cards lately. I have been really busy with other stuff. Nevertheless, I will try to get on this stuff as soon as I um, have the time. So, if we can get a combo of exactly 22, this would be a good time to do that, probably. Let's see what we can do. Here we go. Here we go. As we go after a Giratina in its origin form. All right. 22 combo. I shouldn't have used Darkrai and Yveldal. That was not a good move on my part. I'm probably going to beat this thing before we'd have a chance to get the combo anyway, to be honest. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, so it was kind of pointless, I guess, to go for um, 22 combo. Only there was a 17 combo, and that thing just goes down. That's okay. All right, so 1% catchability. So far, I think we've only ever captured a uh, Escalation Battle Pokemon under 10% once. Or was it only under 30% once, to be honest? <laughs> But there we go. With that, we have taken down Giratina. All right. Let's just keep going. Maybe we can get an angry Giratina at some point. That would be kind of nice. All right. Uh, I'm going to bring Giratina Altered Form. Just because it looks different. And that makes it easier to combo. In time battles, that is. All right. Let's go. 50 seconds on the clock. Let's make this happen. So, are you kidding me? The combo just ended just like that. Alright, we're not going to get the combo we need. But, we are going to get a victory. And that's that. Yep, we're going to miss out on that 22 combo. But... You know, at least we're going to get another chance of catching this Giratina. That would be kind of nice. Okay, come on, Giratina. You know you want to stay in that 2% Pokeball. 2%. Stranger things have happened. Though not very many. I don't know. Then again, it's possible. Steelix broke out 98% and fled, so... 2% is possible. Whatever. That's okay. Giratina, I forgive you. 
That's it, let's keep going. Honestly, I, I'm more after the, um, the combo. Are you kidding me? That's a way to break a combo. Welp. Alright. No mega evolution necessary there. We're gonna take the thing down. Maybe we can catch it. Probably not. 3%, you know. What are you gonna do? Alright. 1 in 33, roughly. 1 in 33. <laughs> okay. That's okay. That is okay. I don't feel too bad about that. Alright, we're not going to get an angry uh, Giratina right there, unfortunately. But we're going to bring it up to number four, so... You know. Let's see what happens. Let's just see what happens. 50 seconds on the clock. Let's do this. Let's make something happen. Are you kidding me? The thing was still moving. These combos are so fragile. No way we get the 22 combo here. But Giratina is once again going to go down. So, you know. Maybe we can catch it this time. 4%? 1 in 25. 1 in 25. I mean, it's, you know. You never know. Stranger things have happened. 1 in 25! That's what I'm talking about! All right, that might be the best escalation battle capture I ever had. 4%. 4%. So, it has an attack power of 80, the ghost typing, and the ability sinister power. With that, we captured Giratina in its origin form. I don't know how I feel about sinister power, though, because it's very good for something like Zoroark. I guess this will be something other than Zoroark can get it. But it's actually really nice for Zoroark. It isn't the best activation rate, though, but it's good for combos. I don't know why they gave it to a ghost type. Maybe if they did something like it helped ghosts and dark, but then it might become a little too broken. I don't know. I mean, Giratina Origin Form has it has ten. It's a ten point boost over Zoroark, but I think Zoroark can get raised max levels, so ultimately. You're better off with Zoroark. So, I mean, I don't know why they did that. They should have given it an ability that would raise ghost types in a combo. That would probably make a little more sense. Also, they gave its altered form, like, arguably one of the best abilities in the game. So, I don't know how I feel about that that they did this with the origin form. I mean, Power 4 Plus is, in my opinion, is better. Uh, so, honestly, I mean, for combos, I guess you're better off with the Sinister Power, even if you were... even if it's not a Dark type, which it's not, but you could use other Dark types, because it's a good combo skill, whereas Power 4 Plus only works at the beginning of a combo. That said, I really don't know how I feel about Giratina origin form compared to Altered form. I, I guess I have to say I prefer the altered form, which is unfortunate, but that's okay. Alright, so we want to use Mega Slowbro three times. Or, we could try something else. You know what, let's try this one. I'm going to try Galvantula with Mega Aerodactyl. Just because. So, let's head on over to, uh... Wrong direction. Let's go to Rosie's Tenture. Alright, so we need to do Galvantula. Seven Mega Aerodactyls. Okay. It's go time. Alright. You 
Now I'm thinking I'm gonna bring Delphox. Charizard is too good not to use, especially because it has, it can burn and it has, you know, that attack power of 105. So I'm gonna bring that. I'm gonna use a Mega Star here. Now we need to do the, um, you do this seven times. So I'm thinking that we should be able to do that if we get the Mega Evolution off right away. I wanna use a plus five just in case. Let's go. Just to be safe, because I don't feel like wasting a Mega Start. We should have more than enough moves to do this though, to be honest, especially considering the the um, Mega Start. Now we do have Reshiram, which is kind of nice, and I should have actually brought Joltik, actually. I completely forgot the stage. I completely forgot the stage. Well. That's unfortunate. Alright, so you're gonna do that. And paralyze yourself. That's fine with me. Okay. Can I burn this thing? Alright, so far I only got one mega effect off. That thing's starting to annoy me. Alright. So that's three mega effects. I definitely should have brought the Joltik, because it would have, if I recall, it would have added more, um, well, rocks. Alright, it's four. We should be good at this point. Because we still need more of them, but they will eventually uh, happen, I suppose. You see, this is what happens when you don't remember what you're doing. <laughs> okay. So. I might be the victim of a bad memory, but, you know, it could be worse. Could be worse. Okay. I don't know why I did that. Cause it's not like I can burn that thing or anything. Alright. The good thing is, since I did bring the, um... The plus five moves, we have a little bit more leeway here. might break stuff, maybe not. Who knows? Whatever. Well, what are you gonna do? Alright, let's do this. Now we can get some rocks broken. Can this thing stop with the barriers? More of that, so we can break more rocks like that. Hmm. Well. Hmm. If I do this, that didn't work. <laughs> of course it didn't work. Why would that work? Alright. That, I guess, wasn't too bad. Gonna add more rocks there. So, at least break some of those rocks for us. So now, let's do this. Well, if we somehow win, the plus five definitely matter. Well, will have mattered.
See, it's very important to keep track of what each stage entails, because you never know when it'll be important to remember stuff. Alright. Let's do that. That didn't work. <laughs> Alright, I'm pretty sure we got this. I'm pretty sure we have this in the bag at this point. It would need to get pretty bad for us not to have it at this point. Alright, now we can just go for the Mega Aerodactyl. And that should finish it off. There we go. The plus five definitely mattered right there. If we brought Joltik instead of, I guess, Delphox. Either Delphox or Charizard. If we brought Joltik instead, we would have had a lot easier job there. But, you know, we did it somehow. Somehow we did it. <laughs> it probably shouldn't be as difficult as we had as um, the challenge we had right there. Like I said, make sure you bring Joltik this way and get her will help a lot more because there will be rocks in the skyfall, if I recall. So you definitely want to do that. Don't do uh, the, the, the foolish stuff I do sometimes. <laughs> yes, I am kind of foolish when you think about it. Yeah, so let's go check in. Also, let's get the results from the Mega Gyarados competition. Alright, so we ranked number 3,474 overall, so we got a mega speed up, 500 coins, and did we not get the Gyaradosite? I am so confused right now, did we not get the Gyaradosite? I figured we would, we got the speed up. Hmm. Um, where are you, Gyarados? Ah, right, here we go. We do have it. So, the Mega Gyarados does the same thing as Mega Latias. It does a random jagged line. Um, that can intersect. Not like the parallel lines like Latios and Scizor. And it's water type. Takes six speed ups. And Shiny Mega Gyarados! takes 10 mega speed ups and it does the same thing as Mega Gengar. So in the end, it'll take, if you fully candy it up, it takes 19 icons to Mega Evolve. If you give it 10 candies, it will actually do um, better than Gengar probably. So I actually might candy up this thing because I have 11 speed ups thanks to that competition. So I might just do that because this way it'll be pretty much a water type Mega Gengar. And that is actually some good coverage, because this way we'd have a super effective Mega against those ground types, those rock types, those fire types, and that could actually be really helpful. Plus, we'd be able to use something, we'd be able to use something that's not resisted against normal types um, for those stages. So this could open up possibilities very well for us. I know there's also Mega Rayquaza we have, and um, Mega Rayquaza is definitely, I still think probably ultimately a better Mega overall, but only because it'll get rid of other Pokemon, not just itself. Whereas here you just get rid of all the Gengar, or in this case Gyaradoses, and that's it. Then you can't go for it again until you start accumulating them. Whereas the Rayquaza, you go for Rayquaza, the next turn if you have enough, you go for another Rayquaza and you can just get rid of another um, type of Pokemon. So ultimately, I, I still have to give the uh, credit to Rayquaza there, but I'm still thinking of fully candying up Mega, Ra Mega Gyarados, so be sure to tell me what you guys think, because this will just basically be, an, uh, it is basically the same thing as Gengar, and Gengar has arguably one of the best um, skills in the game. I guess it's not so arguable. The only reason it would be arguable is because of Rayquaza, but, you know, whatever. To each his own, I suppose. So at some point in the foreseeable future, we are going to have to go after Deoxys Itemless. I know it's possible. I, I've uh, heard of some ways of doing that. So at some point, we will go do that. But for now, we still have these missions to do. This one, I figured, would take some items. I know that the Eveltal one, I heard a lot of things about. I heard that it's almost impossible without using a jewel. Because clearing away 40 clouds is going to be difficult. We're probably going to have to use a few jewels to do that, assuming the GS doesn't change that. 
For right now, I'm not going to expect them to. I'm just going to take my time with getting to it. So I'm going to wait until toward the end before I get to this mission. Um, I'm expecting I'm going to have to use some jewels for it, and I'm okay with that. In fact, just to make sure I don't beat it too soon, I might actually just bring some of the uh, some neutral low attack power Pokemon. So I know for a fact, even if I'm going to be using some jewels, I won't accidentally beat it too soon. As for Gotharita, that's going to be a fun one, won't it? Yeah, exactly 22 matches. I mean, let's see what we can do. Let's see what we can do. It all depends. And Conkelder, Tower of Five. That you know, that could be that could be a challenge. Could be a challenge, but you know, you know, there's Gengar, there's Mew, and well, there's others, I'm sure. Mega Boost five times against Snorlax. That that might actually be a bit of a challenge because, you know, you have to make sure you don't Mega Evolve too soon. I don't know. Next time, I guess we're going to continue with these mission cards, I suppose. And to those of you who are going after the uh, Jirachi this week, I wish you guys the best of luck in getting that. Hopefully, Jirachi will make your dreams come true. And I wish you guys the best of luck in getting up the... Escalation battle with Giratina in its origin form. So thank you for watching. As always, like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. Goodbye.